got a lesson that I wanna teach. I'ma show you that where you from. No matter to me, to me. She said, Hola, come on, stop. She said, Konnichiwa. She said, Father, my friend. I said, Bandu, my dog. I probably don't know what the fuck he says, but I love that jam, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, all you beautiful bastards, and this is the vet. Today's topic is quite simple. It's just gonna ask yourself one simple question. What would you do if you won a hundred million bucks? A lot of people have the common suggestions of I would quit the job, I would get into real estate, I would retire. A whole bunch of reasons which are all quite civilized and quite reasonable. All days are well and good, but you fail to put into perspective one simple thing, human nature. You think you're a nice person, you think you have a grasp on who you are as an individual. No, a hundred million bucks would change your perspective on everything. Do you know what I would do if I won a hundred million? Especially me, if, if you're like me, anybody like me, upper middle class, that's what they call us, upper middle class. Let me explain it for those who understand. So if you can still rock up with your boys, but at the same time be able to take one or two females out for the night, with all this and still make your rent, that's basically you, upper middle class. You fit into that exact category. If you're upper middle class, if you're like me or worse, I don't want to explain worse because that's just, just sad. So if you're upper middle class or worse, do you know what would happen if you won a hundred million bucks? Nine times out of ten, you would lose your shit. All those things that you deem necessary, all those things that you deem valuable will disintegrate from existence. Do you know what I would do if I won? Me? Personally? Do you know what I would do if I won? First thing I want to do is call up every individual, whoever undervalued me for any reason in life. First off, I'd call my former boss who supposedly let me go because I couldn't make it to work on time and that meant that I didn't value my job enough. No, I'm just lazy, that's who I am. So I call up that nigga, Mr. Karanja. Yes, Ricky. Suck it, click. Second, I'd call that bitch, sorry. I'd call that female, is that better? I'd call that female who supposedly left me because I couldn't take her places or buy her shit and I'd be like, hey Stacy. yes, Ricky? You know why she's nice. She's nice because she know that you know that she know that you know that she know that you want 100 million bucks. So she gonna be nice as shit. Hey Ricky, suck it. Click. Third, I'd call my boss. Yep, my current employer. I'd call that nigga up. Good morning, sir. Yes, Ricky. Kindly hold. Let me have your phone right quick. Highest professor, are you sure that I'm the one who won 100 million more? No clerical errors or shit like that? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Do that? Yes. Suck it. Click. Check me out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. All my shit is in the description below. Like, comment, and share the video. And don't forget to subscribe. The link is here, 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 and right about here. This has been the vent. Until next time, peace.